The cash for query scandal has blown up. Union Minister Ashwini Vaishnav responded to BJP MP Nishikant Dubey after his complaint against TMC MP Mahua Moitra. Uh, अपने पत्र में अश्विनी वैष्णव ने कहा कि ये जो मुद्दा उठाया जा रहा है बीजेपी के एम पी निशिकांत दुबे द्वारा ये बहुत ही सीरियस मुद्दा है और एनआईसी इस मामले में पूरा कोऑपरेशन करेगी एथिक्स कमेटी के साथ निशिकांत दुबे ने दरअसल ये रिस्पांस आईटी मिनिस्टर का सोशल मीडिया पर शेयर किया और महुआ मोइत्रा से सवाल पूछे और निशिकांत दुबे ने यह आरोप भी लगाया कि महुआ मोइत्रा ने दरअसल देश की सुरक्षा को खतरे में डाला है ये राजनीति की बात नहीं है निशिकांत दुबे कह रहे हैं कि ये देश की सुरक्षा की बात है साथ ही उन्होंने ये भी कहा कि उन्होंने अब एक धर्म युद्ध की शुरुआत कर दी है जवाब भी इसका आया महुआ मोइत्रा की तरफ से जिन्होंने आरोप लगाया कि बीजेपी केवल उनको टारगेट करना चाहती है यह बीजेपी का हिट जॉब है महुआ मोइत्रा ने यह भी दावा किया कि दो दिन पहले बीजेपी के एमपी निशिकांत दुबे ने कहा था कि एनआईसी ने डिटेल्स दे दी हैं दुबई के लॉगिन की डिटेल्स भी जांच एजेंसी को फिर आईटी मिनिस्टर झूठ क्यों बोल रहे हैं कि जानकारी साझा की जाएगी जब लोकसभा के पैनल से उनसे पूछा जाएगा लेट्स ऑल्सो नाउ लिसन इन टू बिजनेस टाइकून दर्शन हिरानंदानी द मैन एट द हार्ट ऑफ द कैश फॉर क्वेरी स्कैंडल हु ट्राई टू डक अ डायरेक्ट क्वेश्चन व्हेन आस्क्ड अबाउट द दुबई लिंक यू डिड यूज द लॉगिन एंड पासवर्ड ऑफ हर लोकसभा मेंबर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट अकाउंट फॉर आस्किंग क्वेश्चंस Did you actually use them from Dubai, uh, Ms. Hira Nandani? And uh, did it ever cross your mind that this was probably uh, not quite the right thing to do? Certainly, um, uh, that part is an error of judgment. Some members of Parliament in the BJP have raised the question about national security. To be honest, I I have no idea about all of that. I can only state the facts. How often did you use that login uh, account uh, to put in questions? uh via mohua moitra in parliament i i think let the record come out i think it will it will speak for itself aur is waqt ek badi khabar aa rahi hai nishikant dubey ne ek bar phir se war kiya hai mohua moitra par aur nishikant dubey keh rahe hain ki ye sansad ke garima ki baat hai ye desh ki suraksha ki baat hai desh se dhoka kiya gaya hai desh ko gumrah kiya gaya hai we have amita joining us with more details on the latest yes amita स्वाति आज सुबह का नया ट्वीट है निशिकांत दुबे की तरफ से किया गया मैं इसको एक बार पढ़ना चाहूंगी उनका ये कहना है कि सवाल संसद की गरिमा भारत की सुरक्षा व कथित सांसद की प्रॉपर्टी करप्शन एंड क्रिमिनलिटी का है जवाब देना है कि दुबई में एनआईसी मेल खुला कि नहीं पैसे के बदले प्रश्न पूछे कि नहीं विदेश जाने आने का खर्च किसने उठाया कभी लोकसभा स्पीकर व एम इंडिया से विदेश जाने की परमिशन लिया या नहीं सवाल अडानी डिग्री या चोरी का नहीं देश को गुमराह कर आपके भ्रष्टाचार का है डिग्री वाली देश बेचे चंद पैसे के लिए जमीर बेचे जी अमिता शुक्रिया आपका इस पूरी जानकारी के लिए बीजेपी भी जो है लगातार महुआ मोइत्रा पर निशाना साध रही है क्या प्रतिक्रियाएं आ रही हैं वो भी सुन लेते हैं राष्ट्रीय सुरक्षा एक महत्वपूर्ण विषय है और ऐसी जानकारियां जो संसद से जुड़ी हो या फिर जिसके कारण किसी भी तरह का संकट खड़ा हो सकता हो ये नेशनल सिक्योरिटी का इशू के साथ साथ भ्रष्टाचार का इशू भी है और जैसा कि आपको पता है जांच चल रही है हम चाहते हैं कि उचित कार्रवाई भी हो और जांच भी जल्द पूरी हो पार्टी इज कीपिंग एन आई ऑन द होल मैटर एंड वेल मोर इंफॉर्मेशन डेटा एंड रेलिवेंट फैक्ट्स एंड फिगर्स विल कम then only party or uh, the party leadership will come out about these things and so far what mr derek o'brien said that stands all right let's open the seven go across to our guests we have jaydeep mazumdar columnist and tawseef ahmed lawyer and political analyst joining us on the broadcast mr mazumdar uh, the bjp has made this about uh, national security now saying this is about the dignity of the parliament this is about national security it's not just politics and uh, there needs to be a thorough investigation while mahua moitra is uh, alleging that this is just a hit job of the bjp how are you looking at this it's very simple there are two charges against mahua moitra Let let her not go into what about re and try to digress from the main two primary issues. Did she or did she not 
share her password and login details with a businessman number 2 did she or did she not accept cash material benefits hermes bags and everything else for asking questions about uh, uh, on 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 atanis the, the charges are there and the answers are very clear yes she is guilty of both the charges now what uh, the it minister said and who nishikant dube said this first now this is going here and that that is decide the point that is completely irrelevant she is guilty as charged to so, asib i must respond to that you see if bjp says that it is about garima of sadan then the garima of sadan also calls that uh, mr dubey should not file a false affidavit should not be a fake degree holder if he is a fake degree holder he he it does not suit the garima of the sadan you see day by day it is getting murky and murkier if anyone goes to the ethics committee against a member of parliament they should go with clean hands and it is very clear that they have not gone with clean hands two days ago uh, the statement was made that uh, an ic has already given the login details now the minister is saying that th they will give the information in future so you know things are getting only murkier you know whatever it is mamwa moitra has already said that she is open to all investigation she is not shying away and she has denied all charges against her but on the other hand what we see is bjp brigade trying to frame or trying to attack mamwa moitra where they do not have sufficient evidence you know first you should take a cognizance of evidence and then lead the charge here Uh, uh, somehow it is seen that you know they they are preparing the field to for, to make a charge and then you know trying and gather the evidence so you know the lesser said the better it is it is for the ethics committee to sit with all the uh, statements and all the evidence and then take a call and if the probe should continue on mawa moitra then probe should also continue on the charges that mawa moitra has leveled against the bjp ministers and against the corporate house adani so why should one get a preferential treatment just because you have a member of parliament who has gone against the high and mighty of the country she is being made a target at least that is how the perception will be made in the public okay, and no, but, bjp but, is not but, new uh, to this uh, jp mazumdar both sides uh, are jumping uh, to conclusions guilty as charged charge. can only be pronounced by the court after the investigation is over on the other hand those who are backing her are saying she is innocent the bjp is in fact uh, you know only doing this uh, uh, for political vendetta so both sides are jumping the gun isn't it uh, see let us okay i i uh, get your point that uh, Uh, you, you know you're saying both sides are jumping the gun but let let me let me point out one very simple fact mm -hmm. who knows mohua mohua moitra the best apart from her uh, friends and family her party is the best and is the party backing her up mm. it is not backing her up okay she doesn't have very many supporters in the party and why isn't the party backing her up it's very simple uh, the party is fed up of her you know um, uh, mamta banerjee has on many occasions rebuked her in public the videos are there of, of that she whatever she has done her uh, her her expensive uh, bags and uh, uh, other things and and the renovation of the bungalow etc she did it all for her own material benefits for her pleasure the party did not gain anything from it that is why it's very okay. simple the party is not packing her up at, okay toss it ahmed toss it ahmed now that is another way of looking at it that the tmc has distanced uh, itself from mawa moitra what does that say why is there no backing for her because in the past we saw how when cases were registered against the uh, tmc netas uh, the west bengal government took a stand saying this is political vendetta by the bjp we saw a war of words you see it is wrong to say that in this case uh, party is not backing or has dumped mawa moitra you see there are personal matters involved in this case from the very beginning party has said 
that uh, she must defend, she must, uh, you know, um, uh, come out of it, she must uh, say her side, let the committee uh, come to a conclusion, and then party will take an action. You know, nobody I, said I the party has dumped her. There is a, there is a there difference is also, between distancing uh, yourself from Mahua Moitra and uh, dumping Mahua Moitra. So nobody is saying that the party has dumped her. But let's listen to the statements coming in from the party members. Let's uh, listen into Riju Dutta. Now, Justin, uh, Darshan Hiranandini have come out on camera and have said that the, all the allegations about Mohua Maitra is true. What is the TMC party stand? Uh, I, as the spokesperson of the party, cannot say anything on this topic other than what has already been said by our member of parliament and Rajya Sabha leader, Mr. Derek O'Brien. We have observed the reports in the media. The party high command has asked the member, honorable member of parliament in question to clarify her position. She has clarified her position already. All right, let's uh, go back to our guest. So uh, you heard that and in fact uh, what Derek O'Brien earlier said was also, you know, the MP will have to uh, answer. Let her uh, clarify her position. The mayor and minister of Bengal, Mr. Firhad Akim, has also spoken. Hmm. Go ahead, go ahead, Tosif Ahmed, go ahead, please. Finish your point. Yes, see, you, you see, there is, there is Mr. Jai Dehadrai's involvement in this matter. Mawa Moitra is fighting a custody battle with her. They were in a close personal relationship and that, uh, that relationship has ended. All that angle is there. We have to respect someone's personal life. And we have also seen a statement by the uh, mayor and the minister in West Bengal, Mr. Firhad Akim. He has spoken in a personal capacity and he has said, that Ms. Mahua Moitra is being targeted because uh, she has raised voice against the um, uh, corporate house and okay. linked it to the prime minister. But then minister. you have Derek O'Brien you know, who says since the matter the has to do with an elected MP, uh, her Mr. rights Parliament. and privileges, let the matter be investigated by the right yes. forum of parliament. Mr. Majumdar, you know, uh, the, the point in question or the issue in question is not her personal life or the battle that she is fighting with Jay Dehadrai in the court over the custody of Henry. It is about sharing the login ID details. It's about the grave allegations that uh, Mr. Darshan Hirandani, who in fact has confirmed that he did have those details in his affidavit, he says he in fact used to draft and post questions directly. Yeah, see, uh, uh, Jay Dehadrai is, a, uh, is not in the picture I, as far as most of us are concerned. He, he is not in the picture at all. He has filed some allegations and those allegations are being looked into. Whatever Mahua Mitra does, in her personal life is her personal problem. No one has any right to comment on that uh, uh, or, or share pictures or anything like that. That is condemnable and that is not right at all. The, uh, as I said right at the beginning, the two main charges against her are one and two, which you have repeated. Is she guilty of that? The, the other person, her co-accused, uh, 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 Hirana Andani, he has admitted that he has uh, come clean on that. Uh, you know, why he has come clean, maybe he has had a change of heart. Uh, uh, and, and so he has decided to come clean. Now, mm. those charges stand against her. All okay, right. it is for the courts to decide, ultimately right. pronounce her guilty or not guilty. It's for the ethics committee to look into that. Absolutely. It does not jump the gun. Absolutely. The but ethics committee the will look into it. Uh, and if the matter reaches the court, then the court will look into it. For the moment, uh, thank you very much, Mr. Majumdar and Tosif Ahmed for joining us on the broadcast. Thank you for your time.